T-Mobile just made a huge announcement for their direct-to-sell technology partnership with Starlink. In case you missed the Super Bowl last night, T-Mobile aired a commercial in which they explained that their T-Mobile Starlink direct-to-sell technology will be available to anyone on any carrier for free, at least until July. They also released some other details, including pricing, so we're gonna be covering all that in today's update video. But first, let me give a brief overview of what Starlink Direct to Sell is for those of you that are new to the channel. So Starlink Direct to Sell technology is basically putting cell phone towers up in space. So Starlink right now is a satellite internet service operated by SpaceX. SpaceX started launching satellites back in like 2019, 2020 timeframe, and they have thousands of active satellites in a low Earth orbit constellation. Those Starlink satellites deliver high-speed satellite internet to Starlink customers that receive service on an antenna or dish. Recently, SpaceX has been updating some of those Starlink satellites with something called direct-to-cell technology. And basically what that is is attaching a cell phone tower to an existing Starlink satellite. Now they have around 500 or so direct-to-cell compatible satellites in low Earth orbit. And really those are just dual purpose satellites where they're delivering not only Starlink high-speed internet, but also direct to cell capabilities to cell phones on the ground. Since Starlink's satellite constellation covers the entire globe, with Starlink direct to cell, as soon as you go out of range of your existing cell network, you'll pick up the cell phone signal directly from the Starlink satellites and you'll have coverage basically anywhere in the world. That means no more cell phone dead zones. The process is completely seamless since the Starlink satellites are just beaming down a typical cell phone signal and your cell phone will automatically pick it up and connect to it just like any other cell service. The best part about Starlink's direct-to-cell technology is that it doesn't require any special hardware. You can use your existing cell phone because again, it's just a normal cell phone signal that you're receiving from those satellites in space. No extra hardware, specialty phones or anything like that required, it just works. Now, right now, it only supports basic text messaging, including text messaging to 911 but those capabilities will expand in the future to being able to uh, do voice calls, limited amounts of data, sending pictures, things like that. In the United States, T-Mobile has decided to partner with Starlink to deliver this service throughout the country, but they've partnered with other carriers in other countries as well. And that brings us kind of to the big announcement or the point of this video. That ad during the Super Bowl yesterday revealed that any carrier is gonna be supported on T-Mobile Starlink direct to sell, which is huge news. It kind of shocked me and kind of shocked everyone, I think. After that commercial, I had to go online and check out the T-Mobile website, and they had a ton of additional details regarding T-Mobile Starlink and their partnership and the upcoming plans for the full rollout. Let's start, though, with the current beta program, which is in progress right now. The T-Mobile Starlink beta has been going on for a few weeks now, and that lets anybody in the United States that is a T-Mobile customer sign up for early access to Starlink direct to sell technology. During the beta program, access is free, assuming that you're accepted into the program, so it doesn't cost anything to use that direct to sell technology. During that ad, T-Mobile announced that their beta program would cover people from any carrier, so no longer just limited to T-Mobile customers, and that's free until July when the beta program ends and the full product release rolls out. And that's huge news. So if you have AT&T or Verizon or any other carrier, you can go onto the T-Mobile website and sign up for their Starlink beta program right now and get access, assuming that you have a newer phone. That's kind of like the only caveat right now is that you need a phone released in the last few years. I'll link a page below in the description that has a list of supported phone models. And also access into the beta program is kind of first come first serve. So you need to sign up as soon as you can to be able to utilize that free service until July. All right, so what happens after July when T-Mobile Starlink fully launches to the public? Well, we have some more details now. The T-Mobile the page has been updated to have some pricing information. So in the previous video that I did on Starlink direct to sell I mentioned that T-Mobile wanted to monetize this technology be able to kind of earn some revenue off of it. T-Mobile has now revealed the pricing levels depending on which phone plan that you have. And just like with the beta program, it's not limited to just T-Mobile customers. Anybody from any carrier will be able to buy T-Mobile Starlink and get access to it without a separate phone line or separate phone plan from T-Mobile. So here's how the pricing breaks down. If you're a T-Mobile subscriber on the Go 5G Next plan, 
then you won't pay, pay anything extra for T-Mobile Starlink. It's included as a, as a feature as a part of that plan. Now that is like their most expensive plan, so you're paying for it in a way, but just know that if you're a Go, a Go 5G Next subscriber, you'll get T-Mobile Starlink included for free. If you're on any other T-Mobile plan, you can sign up for $15 per month to get access to T-Mobile Starlink. Now that's a feature add-on and it looks like it's gonna be able to, you know, be added on and then taken off on demand. So you can sign up for it when you need it. Let's say you're going on a, on a trip or something. And then when you get back, you can remove it if you don't wanna keep paying for it. An important note, if you're a T-Mobile subscriber and you're interested in Starlink direct to sell they have an early adopter promotion going on right now. So if you sign up before March 1st, you can actually get $5 knocked off of that monthly price. So that means you'll pay $10 a month if you're a T-Mobile subscriber and you sign up before March 1st. If you're not a T-Mobile customer, let's say you have a phone plan with Verizon or AT&T, you can still get access to T-Mobile Starlink direct to sell. You can actually sign up through T-Mobile for $20 per month and that's not like a separate phone plan or anything. It's just the monthly fee that you pay to T-Mobile to get access to that. And it's basically like an extended roaming partner. So your current Verizon or whatever you have cell phone plan, as soon as you go out of range of the Verizon network, you'll be roaming onto the T-Mobile SpaceX extended network, which is the direct to sell network. So you will be paying T-Mobile that fee for that feature, but it's not like you're signing up for like another phone plan or anything. We also got some additional information that answers some of the common questions that you all had from my previous videos. So one of the big questions was international travel. Um, the T-Mobile website right now says that T-Mobile direct to sell, the T-Mobile Starlink partnership is only available across the United States right now. So it's limited to the United States you don't have international travel ability right now, but in their FAQs on the T-Mobile website, they do say that that is a feature that's coming soon. So I assume that'll roll out with regulatory approvals or as the satellite constellation grows to support more international travel. It also says that open water use, like on the ocean, will be an upcoming feature that'll be supported. So that answers another question. You know, let's say you're on a cruise ship or something, will you have cell phones, a cell phone signal through T-Mobile Starlink, and the answer, at least in the future at some point, will be yes. So those were the major updates that we learned last night. So this is super exciting stuff. The end of cell phone dead zones is upon us, and T-Mobile is leading the way in their partnership with Starlink. I was especially shocked to see that commercial where they're opening up their Starlink uh, T-Mobile partnership to anybody, regardless of your carrier. So it'll be free until July, and then after July, you'll just have to pay a small monthly fee to have access to the feature, but it's still super exciting stuff, and it just gives, gives T-Mobile such an advantage over their competitors. So as far as competitors go, they have Apple and Google have their own kind of built-in uh, native satellite messaging systems. Apple's is live right now with text messaging, but uh, Google's is, I believe it's SOS only at the moment. And then you have AST Space Mobile, which has partnered with AT&T and Verizon, but they're still in the kind of satellite deployment phase. They're not operational at this point and you can't use their services, but T-Mobile has definitely got the advantage here in terms of getting to market first. They're gonna be able to kind of rope in, I think customers and steal people away from AT&T and Verizon with the cheaper access pricing for Starlink Direct Cell and just the fact that it's gonna be available basically now instead of having to wait for AST Space Mobile to get off the ground. I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments below. If you have any questions about this, these recent developments, let me know, I'll try to answer them. I also wanna give a special shout out to our channel members, their direct contributions help me make videos like this one. If you're interested in joining our channel membership program, click the join button near the description below. Thank you for watching, I'll chat with you in the comments and see you in the next video.